a pilot and where she lives in Chad and she asks is, is there any problem if I'm wearing my hijab and I take the necessary precautions she didn't say whether she's a a, a, a pilot a co-pilot or a solo uh, uh, traveling on her airplane either way the restrictions are one for traveling the Prophet says والسلام, it is not permissible for a woman who believes in Allah and the day of judgment to travel without a mahram a mahram is your male relative who can never marry you beside your husband so your husband is your mahram your father son uncle nephew they are your mahrams your uh, stepsons your son-in-law your stepfather your father-in-law these are your mahrams etc so the first problem is with your traveling without a mahram maybe you can solve this by having your husband or your mahram working as uh, a, a steward in the airplane and then he's traveling all the time the second problem is with mixing so if you are a pilot or a co-pilot you'll be in the cockpit for six hours maximum eight hours this is for you to be legal less than uh, uh, or less and you have all this time alone in seclusion in the cockpit and the Prophet said that um, whenever a man is alone with a woman the third one with them in their seclusion is shaitan is the devil and we know I have like hundreds of stories of what's happening in layovers in um, uh, when traveling for training for recurrent uh, etc things that are okay not everyone would fall into but the possibility is always there and hence Islam prohibits a woman from working such a job and Allah Azza wa Jal knows best Khadija from uh, Mauritius